Over the years, many mysterious creatures have washed up on beaches. During a boating trip with his son in Wolf Island National Wildlife Refuge Center, near Golden Isles, Georgia, Jeff Warren said he spotted what he thought was a seal that had washed up on the sand. He realized it was something that looked a whole lot more prehistoric, describing it as a Loch Ness type thing unlike anything he'd spotted in the water before. Birds were already pecking at the five foot long creature's carcass, but Warren was able to snap a picture. Afterwards, he and his son stopped by a local restaurant and speculated over what it might be. Some of the locals suggested it could have been the Ulti, a Loch Ness monster type creature rumored to run the waters in the area. However, despite several calls to marine life experts, none have been able to provide a definitive answer as to what it might be. Plesiosaurs first appeared in the late Triassic period around 203 million years ago. These dinosaurs had very sharp teeth and incredibly strong jaws. This allowed them to not only feed on fish of all sizes, but also on any other swimming animals that may have been in the oceans at the time. Their strong jaws and sharp teeth may have also allowed them to eat a mollusk that lived along the prehistoric shoreline. This creature is characterized by their long necks, sleek bodies, small heads and wide flippers. Despite their sleek bodies, Plesiosaurs were far from the fastest marine reptiles of the Mesozoic era. One of the developments that doomed the Plesiosaurs of the late Cretaceous period was the evolution of faster, better adapted fish, not to mention the evolution of more agile marine reptiles like Mosasaurs. Even before a living sea camp was found in 1938 off the coast of Africa, people known as cryptozoologists have speculated about whether all the Plesiosaurs really went extinct 65 million years ago along with their dinosaur cousins. Vast regions of the world's oceans remain to be explored, and it doesn't defy belief that a living plesiosaur may one day be scooped up in a fishing net. Of course, there could be a perfectly normal explanation for what this thing actually is. As some outlets have pointed out, occasionally creatures that decompose in the ocean can appear elongated after a while, and may no longer even vaguely resemble whatever they once were. Specifically, something like a 30-foot basking shark can decompose in a way that it ends up looking like a plesiosaur, and this has happened on many occasions. So what do you guys think this creature is? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.